fish. This is our grandmother fish. She lived a long, 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 long time ago. She could wiggle and swim fast. Can you wiggle? Kaisa, can you wiggle? Oh, sure, Sita can wiggle. Good job. And she had chaws to chomp with. Can you chomp? <laughs> okay, there's grandmother fish, cousin shark, cousin ray finned fish, grandmother reptile. Grandmother fish had many kinds of grandchildren. They could wiggle and chomp. Can you find our grandmother reptile? Right here. Yeah. This is our grandmother reptile. She lived a long, 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 long time ago. Four. Four. One, two, three. You're right. She could crawl across the ground. Can you crawl? Crawl. No, except, can you crawl? Nice. And she could breathe air in and out. In and out. And in and out. Nice. Grandmother Reptile also had many kinds of grandchildren. They could wiggle and chomp and crawl and breathe. There's Reptile. Can you find our grandmother Mammal? Yeah, Which one of these would be a mammal? Mammal. Mm -hmm. What kind of a mammal is that? A tree mammal. A tree mammal? Maybe. Her babies could squeak when they were hungry. Can you squeak? <laughs> and she could cuddle with her babies and feed them milk. Milk. Can you cuddle? Mm. Oh, cuddle, cuddle, cuddle. I love your cuddles. Grandmother Mammal had many kinds of grandchildren. They could wiggle and chomp and crawl and breathe and cuddle and squeak. Can you find our grandmother Ape? Right there. Yeah. There's a picture of her. This is our grandmother Ape. She lived a long, long time ago. Three. Try that again. A long, long time ago. Two. Yeah. And her, what's she have on her back? A baby. A baby. She could grab branches and climb. Can you grab? <laughs> yep. She could hoot when she was happy. Can you hoot? <laughs> Grandmother Ape had many kinds of grandchildren. They could wiggle and chomp and crawl and breathe and cuddle and squeak and grab and hoot. Really? That's a grandchildren? Yeah. We're all related. See the path? Grandmother um, Ape is related to Cousin Gibbon and uh, Cousin Orangutan, uh, Cousin Gorilla. Yeah. And look, starting to walk a little bit more upright. Cousin Chimp and Grandmother Human. Yeah. Can you find our Grandmother Human? You already found her. Good job. There she is. Human. This is our Grandmother Human. She lived a long time ago. She could walk on two feet. Can you walk? Sure you can. And she could talk to other humans. Can you talk? Yes. Can you talk, Siri? Yes. Good job. Grandmother human had many kinds of grandchildren. They could wiggle and chomp and crawl and breathe and cuddle and squeak and grab and hoot, and walk, and talk. And I see one of them right here. Right here. <laughs> <laughs> Two of them right here. And one of them right here. Which one are you, do you think? Mm. 
That's fine. That so one. Oh, we'll big sister and little sister. Uh, All right, then. Let's see. This is Mama. This is Dada. The end. Yeah, we are all grandchildren of Grandmother Human. And then yeah, that really is the end. It talks we're really, a lot. We're really children of Grandmother Human. Yeah, we're all. And it starts really... out of a fish. Whoa. <laughs> Pretty cool. So we fish. are fish. I thought that it was really fantastic how it's a, evolution is a very complex subject to grasp and it really simplified it and it made it um, easy for my kids to comprehend and see those connections. The cousins and you know the individual branches, the you know these kinds of diagrams. I think the six-year-old who's very sciencey is gonna zero in on that and uh, and kind of ask lots of questions and say, wait, cousin dinosaur, how's that related to us? And you know he's got elements from various TV shows and things like birds related to dinosaurs. So I think it'll help him start uh, fitting some of the pieces of the puzzle together. I thought it was fun. Well, uh, why was it fun? Because I liked how it taught you how humans actually came alive. And how did they actually come alive? Well, they started out as animals, and then they eventually became a monkey and then a human. 